Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial, I will show you how you can actually remove or create, like create a table and then remove it if you felt like it's not necessary good. So, first of all guys, I will need you to go ahead and open your Microsoft 365 and then go ahead and open Microsoft Excel. Now, let's go ahead and open a blank workbook or an already project. So, let me just open somewhere in here. Okay, and let me just name it table. Now, what I'm going to do is first add in a table. So, how you can actually add a table, go to insert, and here you have this table. Now, let me just select like um, some somewhere like so. Let me just select all of these. Something like that will do the job. And here we go. Now, as you can see, I have created this table. If I click here, you will not have the the table menu. But if you click uh, anywhere like in the table section, you will find that the table design has been added in here. So now, how we can actually remove it? Basically, if you go to table design, you will find a lot of uh, like a lot of options. So let's say that you wanted to remove this table. So basically, these two options, which are delete, which is pretty simple. So we click delete table column table row. So let's for example, delete columns. As you can see, it has been deleted. Let's go back. If you want to delete one thing, you can go here, delete and delete rows. If you want to delete one column, you can go here, delete columns. And if you did something like that and you deleted the rows, you will delete everything. So make sure that if you select the correct thing and you're deleting the correct thing as well. So if you select the rows, make sure that you remove the, the rows. If you select the columns, make sure that you have removed the columns. So yeah, guys, that's how you can actually remove a table in Microsoft Excel. Thanks a lot for watching and see you in the next tutorial.